A lot of you have requested for a guacamole video. This is my simple recipe. I really hope you like it. It all starts with some firm avocados, salt, a jalapeno chili or any chili will do, whatever you like, some lime juice, a scallion, I've used the whole thing, white and green, and some coriander. It starts by prepping your avocados, so I just cut around them. There's a seed inside, so you can't cut through and through. And then I just pop it open like that, and I use my knife to take out the seed. Just be careful over here that you don't hurt yourself, um, and then you just pop it out like that. It's very simple. You don't really need the seed, so you can discard that. And then with a spoon, it's just easy to scoop out the avocado. Uh, of course, make sure that you have a ripe avocado because if it's not ripe, then this is going to be a struggle. And as soon as I pop it out, I just like to add a little bit of lime to it so that the avocado does not turn yellow or brown, which I'm told it does. Now for the rest of the ingredients, I've just chopped them up roughly and then actually a guacamole is made in a mortar and pestle where you sort of pulverize it and pound them till they mush down a little and I didn't want to do that because it's difficult so with the back of my knife, I just keep pressing it down and then chopping it to sort of give it that muddling motion. I don't know if that makes sense to you but as you can see, I just keep chopping. It takes a little bit of time but in between the chopping, you just take the back of your knife and you press it down just so that it flattens out a little bit and then you just keep going till you get the right consistency. So as you can see now this is a lot finer and I like it at this consistency so this is what I'm going to use but I feel like it could do with a lot more muddling and mushing so just go till as much as you can do. I think this is okay. Now with my fork, I just mash my avocado. Um, I started out with two, but unfortunately I'm only using one because the second one wasn't ripe and it was just a mess. Um, so I'm just using one and I keep mashing it up. And then to this mixture, I add in my um, chilies and coriander and everything that I mushed and muddled and the salt, of course, don't forget the salt. And that's pretty much it. That is your guacamole. It's as simple as that. Now a lot of people like to add onion, red onion and tomatoes to their guacamole. I do not. I find a lot of recipes are like this. So it really depends on what you want. You can add them but I don't. And then I just pop it out into a container and enjoy them with some chips. So I really hope you like this. If you do, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Do subscribe to the channel, drop a comment and I hope, I really hope this was useful to you since it was so highly requested and I will see you very soon.